The Cambridge interview process is um, it's very important to see this as one part of the assessment. So we look at many things about each candidate. In our minds when we're doing an interview, the sorts of things we're thinking about are whether or not the uh, person in front of us has the right kind of background knowledge needed for our courses, uh, whether we think they'd be successful in our kind of teaching environment. And to put it in a nutshell really, can they think? For a technical interview like uh, natural sciences or engineering or mathematics, then what we're looking for is how teachable they are, we're looking at how interested in the material they are, how they can take an idea and develop that, even if it's something that they perhaps haven't necessarily seen before. So it's going to start by sketching a function, and the function yeah. that I'm going to write down you've probably not seen before, okay. but I'm fairly sure that you've all seen the pieces of that function. Okay. So, if I write down the function is y is equal to sine x divided by x. Okay? Yeah. And what I would like you to do is sketch the behaviour of that function between minus 2 pi and 2 pi. And so if you can sketch some axes for me and give that a go. First of all, I'm going to start and get some of the main points that I need to mm -hmm. work out. So I'm going to start with x is equal to 0. Okay, so if I can just stop you there for a second, because yep. x is equal to zero is a little bit tricky. So yep. choosing some points is a good idea, absolutely, yep. but we might just come back to that one. So are there any other points that you know the values of? Um, pi mm -hmm. is a okay. fairly good one. Okay. Um, so sine of pi will be zero, and so zero divided by pi is zero. Mm -hmm. Excellent. Even when she was getting to the stage of being uncertain about what to draw, and you could see the hesitation, she would nevertheless draw something, and that gave the opportunity to say, well, yes, that's sort of in the right direction, you need to change this a little bit. So, that would be... <laughs> yeah, have a scribble if yeah. it helps. Uh, what was this one? That was two-thirds. Mm -hmm. What's this one? That's minus... Two thirds of pi. Oh yeah. So that'll be more like minus two ninths. Yeah. Good so to be a lot smaller. If candidates are very hesitant and very unwilling to write things down or say things, it's very difficult for us to help them. So keeping the dialogue going is very, very important. The single piece of advice I'd give any student coming for interview is to listen carefully to the questions that they're being asked. And if you don't understand a word, ask for clarification. Be yourself as much as possible. We are assessing you to see whether we can teach you effectively. So the more you are like you in your interview, the better.